well, just look at the stadium for a start. And, and I remember when we played the 92 World Cup final here, the stand at the end had just opened up. Uh, so, yeah, a lot of memories here. Um, I remember being in the dressing rooms working uh, with the, the centenary test here with the England team. And then uh, thinking, well, I wouldn't mind having a game here. And then, then, I, then I got a few games here, yeah. It's always good to be in Melbourne. Uh, Melbourne's probably my favourite city. Uh, I don't particularly like cities. I'm more a country boy. But as Melbourne goes, uh, I like it. Well, I would suggest they get on a plane. It's quite easy. It says Melbourne and get off. Then you'll be here. Uh, it's, it, they should come. It's just, the Boxing Day game is historically a game that everybody that plays in the Ashes, whether it's England or Australian, they want to play in a, a Boxing Day because the atmosphere here is unbelievable and it's great to see that we're going to have full crowds. I've got a hundred here, um, which meant quite a bit to me. Uh, but I think when we played here in 86-7 and we were written off and by the end of the game here, we'd won everything. So, and then we played the one day series and there's another series and we won that. Um, so from being the worst side to leave the shores of England, uh, we conquered everything. A little bit like the Australians did in 89 when they came back to the UK. That, according to the Australian press, that was the worst side that had ever left the shores of Australia. And they gave us a real thumping. So um, yeah, a lot of good memories, but I think 86-7 here wrapping it up will, was a great team performance. Uh, I'd be very happy I saw England win. That would be nice. Look, I, I'm looking forward to a good series. I think it'll be a lot closer than a lot of people over here think.